When you're developing your buyer persona uh, uh, content in terms of keyword research, you also have to bear in mind that uh, there are certain uh, ways that you would be able to target uh, in pay-per-click advertising or PPC or paid way of advertising on search engines. And there are other ways that you'll be able to target uh, in organic or, or, uh, search engine optimization and organic social media optimization as well. All PPC networks such as Google AdWords or Twitter or Facebook work on a similar principle. That you have keywords that you want to specify and you can also target the radius of individuals where that particular ad will appear and essentially you have a chance to really narrow down the individuals that will be interested in a certain content and will be based at a certain period of time. With the organic search engine optimization you will not be able to be as specific so therefore keywords can be somewhat uh, broader in the sense that you will not be able to specify a particular date or a particular uh, event that is happening and especially if you want to have that event on a, a sort of a very quick basis so for example if an event is taking place tomorrow and you were to create some content that is related to this event tomorrow it is very difficult for search engines to pick it up and serve it as the number one event although it's possible but it is still quite a challenge so when you're developing your keyword research bear in mind that the organic SEO and organic social media optimization has to be a more long-term sort of strategic approach think about three four months and the more short-term tactical decisions have to be going down the PPC route. We don't use PPC uh, campaigns uh, or, or invest in PPC activity across Google. The majority of our time and our focus goes on search engine optimization. It's producing relevant content that we can use for SEO purposes on different search engines, but we can also use that content across the social media channels and other you know, marketing channels that exist for us, maybe at conferences and maybe at exhibitions, so that we can you know, use different content across the different elements. PPC is very specific, it can be costly, it can, it can be um, unsuccessful in terms of the investment that you put in and therefore for an SME it's quite a big decision whether you want to invest in a PPC campaign because you need to ensure and be absolutely certain that those um, uh, customers that are coming through to your website are converting purely because of your PPC listing. If you cannot get the tracking right on that then it is a big question mark whether you should be using PPC uh, activity on your digital marketing strategy. Pay per click, uh, you can use it on search campaigns, on display campaigns, or even in uh, social campaigns. So, this means you will pay only if someone click your ad and visit uh, the website. So, when you are looking for certain actions, it's better to use uh, pay per click campaigns because there are other techniques like CPM only for views, paying for views, or even uh, actions as we mentioned in the affiliation marketing. We integrate social media and search optimization into our mix of marketing activities. Our marketing budget is twofold. One, ads, initiative events, which aim at raising more awareness of the brand and would eventually increase sales in the long run. And two, ads which lead to immediate increase of sales. About half of our budget goes to social media and AdWords because it drives sales up. 